Good evening. I'm Erica Sargent. And I'm Brad Edwards. It was a holiday party. A retired priest admits to having a few before he got behind the wheel and struck two teachers in Orland Park, killing one. In a stunning move, the DUI charge was dropped today. Our Charlie DeMar digs into the reason. Retired priest Paul Burak was facing two felony charges for leaving the scene of an accident and aggravated DUI, but that drinking charge has suddenly faded away. Today is a little bit of a stunner for the family um, to find out that they're dropping the impaired driving charges. Attorney Joseph Shannon represents the family of Margaret Roan Leha. Leha, a Catholic school teacher at St. Michael in Orland Park, was run over and killed by Burek in the Orland Square parking lot after a holiday Christmas party last month. Elizabeth Kostek, also a teacher, was hit by Burek but survived. All the evidence points to impairment, and the family wants justice here. Burick told police he polished off a Manhattan, a glass of wine, and meds for his Parkinson's and glaucoma, a concoction causing him to black out. But today, Cook County State's attorney Kim Fox's office dropping the DUI charge, saying the evidence and facts were insufficient to support that charge. There was enough evidence to bring the charges originally, right? I don't know what changed in the last couple weeks. The state's attorney's office saying that the charges that Burek still faces carry, carry a stiffer penalty than the DUI charge that was dropped. Meantime, CBS2 legal analyst Irv Miller says even though Burek drove away and field sobriety tests were never performed, DUI charges can still be brought in, brought in a case, rather, if there is evidence of impairment. Live in the newsroom tonight, Charlie DeMar, CBS2 News, Brad and Erica. Charlie, thank you.